Thousands of Democratic leaders are saying that they not only don't think that he's the strongest candidate, you know, considering the larger field that could be possible given his age and other defects, but they don't think that you are the right person to be on the ticket. Why do you think that? I think that it is very important to focus on the needs of the American people and not political chatter out of Washington, D.C. In other words, Kamala has no clue why nobody likes her. And this isn't something new. Back in 2019, when she was running for president, look how poorly she was doing in the polls and how clueless she was back then as well. And we have accomplished a great amount of work thus far, which makes me a top tier candidate. Although some polls indicate uh, don't know uh, ranks above Kamala Harris. <laughs> and we have accomplished a great amount of work thus far, which makes me a top tier candidate. This week, a new NBC News Wall Street Journal poll has Kamala Harris losing ground with voters and Democrats Elizabeth Warren and Joe Biden strengthening their lead. No, I think what yeah. we're reading into is that yeah. Kamala Harris's campaign is struggling. Right. Um, <laughs> that's what I think we're reading into. I think yeah. we've seen that consistently. They don't think that you are the right person to be on the ticket. Why do you think that? We have accomplished a great amount of work thus far, which makes me a top tier candidate. <laughs> <laughs> oh! 